e-learning revolution has begun in Zamboanga City. The 7E model of constructivist learning approach in the teaching of science. Why use 7E? This approach facilitates learners to construct knowledge and meaning from their experiences. Learners generate their own rules and mental models which they use to make sense of their experiences. It engages students to experiential, hands-on activities which promote development of students' critical thinking skills. The parts of the 7 year teaching model are elicit, engage, explore, explain, elaborate, evaluate, and expand. The 7E Teaching Model Elicit This stage allows students to activate prior learning through relevant questioning or provision of appropriate situations to engage their minds. Engage. This stage mentally engages students with activity, situation, or question. It captures their interests, provides an opportunity for them to express what they know about the concept or skills being developed. It helps them make connections between what they know and the new ideas. Engage is a stage in which events are associated with daily activities. Explore. Students carry out hands-on activities in which they can explore the concept or skill. They grapple with a problem or phenomenon and describe it in their own words. This phase allows students to acquire a common set of experience that they can use to help each other make sense of the new concept or skill. The more the self is involved, the deeper the processing and understanding. Explain. This part provides the formalization of science understanding to happen with substantial discussion. Ideas can be made meaningful to them by linking the experiences in the exploration when providing content input. Only after students have explored the concept or skill does the teacher provide the concepts and terms used by the students to develop explanations for the phenomenon they have experienced. The significant aspect of this phase is that explanation follows experience. The explained part must be enriched with videos for processes that are hard to explain or describe. It contains logically sequenced questions or discussion. Elaborate. This phase allows the students to engage in further experiences that apply, elaborate the concepts, process, or skills after they have an explanation of their learning task. This aids the students to generalize main concepts through the leading questions. Students are exposed to alternative and more advanced applications. Provide task or situation where the concept learned is able to represent in several other ways. Its application beyond what's given or multiple representation of the concept learned. Evaluate. 
this phase provides an opportunity for students to review and reflect on their own learning and new understanding and skills. It is also when students provide evidence for the changes to their understandings, beliefs, and skills. Learners need corrective feedback based on the content knowledge as well as assurance. Extend. This is the phase where teacher provides additional support to learners. Provide enrichment for those who are coping with the lesson and remediation for those who are struggling. The 7E is an expanded form of 5E. Engage, explore, explain, elaborate, and evaluate. Both 7E and 5E have the same learning framework, emphasizing on the activation of prior knowledge, acquisition of new knowledge, application of new knowledge, and assessment of learning. This learning cycle is anchored on the principle of CIA alignment, aligning tasks, questions, and evaluation with the learning competency. Let us all become teachers of relevance by adopting the 7E or the 5E learning models. Classes might be suspended, but learning will continue. 